Although to be fair, it makes less sense for it to be medium timer on this variant, but whatever. Yeah. Okay, all right. So we are playing round four of the 5D Chess Teams Tournament. Uh, the variant this week is alternating turns. What that means is uh, every time it is the each team's t turn, one of the players does all of the moves necessary for them to submit. And then the next time it's their turn, the other player makes all of the moves for that team. So in other words, white is playing now. So the first move is going to be made by either mage or Anith. Uh, we'll have to figure out a way to decide who goes first. Um, and then the next time it's white's turn, the other player will play for white, etc. So every time you hit submit, uh, it change control swaps over to the other player, uh, if that makes sense. Alternating turn uh, turns, so I will be the hand and mage will be the hand for each of the two sides respectively, uh, and so the other player will have to dictate what moves are going to be made, which I guess is the benefit of the long timer. <laughs> uh, hopefully, we don't actually result. Hopefully, we don't flag. Um, you know, and the, and the the game is played in a timely manner, but just as sort of a safety net, so that the uh, practice of saying which moves you want to be made on which board uh, isn't a sort of detriment. You know, we, we've instituted the long timer. So, um, okay, that that is what I understand the rules to be. It's pretty straightforward. Uh, does anyone have any questions or comments or concerns? Yeah, just call me. Uh, lowest elo player plays first. Okay, so in this case, uh, Neath and Smoke would be first players for white and black, respectively, yes? Yep. Okay, fantastic. Uh, now, in terms of communication, obviously no strategy can be discussed between, uh, you know, within each team or across teams. I don't know why you'd want to do that, but you're not allowed. Oh, do, do, does coughing two times to mean play F5? Uh, is that a strategy across teams? Uh, no, that's fine. That specifically <laughs> coughing twice to denote F five is allowed, but no other communication. Um, All right, good because I I didn't know if I'd not that it or not. We had made a pact. Yeah, <laughs> F five. What a what an awful move. Um, I guess I'm all, well, it's pregame, so I don't. <laughs> I don't mind. Uh, no, but I mean, you know, we, we can sort of talk shit and uh, converse, but, you know, uh, we're going to police each other. Don't don't be talking about the game. Don't be insinuate. Don't react in such a way that, you know, you express either concern or delight at the moves that you're um, uh, that, that either your teammate or no, you, you can shit talk the opponent, uh, the opponent's moves, um, just not your own teammates. Um, it's it's intra team communication that we want to limit here. Uh, okay, so if anyone coughs three times, he loses. Um, I'm not sure that I'm down for that house rule, but Andre has made a proposal. Uh, we're just going to move swiftly forward. Uh, if everything is good with everybody, um, we, we can just we can just play, yeah? Everyone ready? Everyone good? Yep. Yep. Oh, yeah. Fantastic. All right, let's, let's fucking go. All Wait, right. Who's playing first? Me or you? You. Okay, cool. This is interesting because I think that both Mage and Neath tend to play E3 openings. Well, then again, Mage played the Daigoli in the last four games I played against, five games I played against him. We were debating whether or not to play the Daigoli, gotta <laughs> say. Why, why not? Well, are, are you not a believer? Uh, I, I just didn't like that the moves uh, of choice fell onto Cement to play. Oh, I see. That's interesting. Okay. Like the trickiest moves would have been your yeah. choice. Okay. Well, we do have long And timer. I feel like I've played you enough in that to where it's a yeah, bit harder. Yeah, I think I could avoid the bigger pitfalls, but I'm, I'm not, I don't know. I think that you could still get me. I haven't played it. Well, that's true. I don't have a fantastic memory, but all right. Uh, wait, Smoke, did you say a move and I just haven't heard you? Oh, wait, did they play something? Yeah, yeah they, they played E3. Oh, Oh, can you stream? Oh, oh sorry, like sorry. I'm not streaming in Discord. Oh, Papega. Oh, my God. 
He Monka wasn't moving S. then tough three times yet. Sag. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, okay, I was sorry. waiting for major signal sorry, to play sorry. F5. Uh, okay. <laughs> all right. Uh, okay. Are we all good? Can you see my stream in the Discord? Yes. Hello. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. Good. <laughs> all right. Just, just so that I'm not tempted to play F5, we're gonna play uh, Knight F6. Okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm down for that. Oh wait. No, I can't express anything. No, you can at their move. Well, I get. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> the disappointment at F5. You know, I I will also express disappointment at F5. Uh, you failed my preparations. Um, you know, we're, we're, I mean, we're just going to play D5. Um, yeah. D4? Oh, okay. Uh, pawn to C6. Spicy. Right out the gate. All right. A cool C6. All right. Okay. Uh, now it's my turn. Uh... You know, for for how many games this has been played against me in a row on stream, you'd think I'd have looked at it at some point and and decided what the actual what the actual best play is here. Um, but no, I really haven't. Oh, well, I, also, you have I should also forty pull minutes up... to think about it. Oh shit! No, only thirty nine now. All right, I sh let me set up the mute and then talk to stream, okay. All right, stream, here's where I lose the game or don't. Uh, do we play, do we do we take with the knight or the queen? I want to take with the queen and then pull the queen back to d8, but then it's up to, like, if I, if I take with the queen, then right, obviously so actually when I knight c3 is going to happen, uh, right? C6, um, I, I wasn't I looking at the board well. and I thought you had said d4. So I didn't know what I was uh, doing. I, I, I should. Well, okay, oh. that's good to know. Yeah, I, I think it's fine, um, but it's not the position I thought we were in. But okay, let, let me let me deafen as well. Okay, here we go. Uh, so I don't fucking. I've noticed this position is a fair bit. Uh, oh, jeez. Okay, what are you playing? This is the team Storny match. Um, it's me and Smoke against Neath and Mage, alternating turns. Um, I need to just. Okay, so what? I'll probably take with the knight, right? Because then knight. Okay, whatever's going to happen, probably knight c3 is going to happen, kicking whatever piece we put on d5. Uh, if I played queen d5, then probably knight c3 is going to happen, and then I don't know where smoke will pull the queen back to. I think... Ugh. I think... I wouldn't put the complicated... I wouldn't put smoke through the complicated G4 thing. I think that would be torturous and irresponsible of me as a teammate. I think the best play is probably... What I've been playing lately is... Uh, queen takes D5, knight C3, just queen D8 straight back. But I don't know where smoke will put the queen. And if he doesn't pull it all the way back to D8, then we're actually fucked. It's a big problem. Um, it's, a, it's a big problem. However... I don't know. I mean, then I, then it's exactly the same position if you play knight takes d5 and then knight c3 and then just knight back to f6 anyway. I'll just take with the queen. Whatever. Who the f gives a fuck? Uh, I, whatever. There's. I don't feel good about it, but... All right, okay. We're going to play queen takes d5. Knight takes I feel c3. no emotion about that. <laughs> All right, smoke. Oh, I have to decide now. Correct. It is now Smoke's turn. Smoke gets, well, as long as there's one timeline, you get odd moves, I get even moves. I, for, I forgot to bring in coin to flip to make the decision. <laughs> I feel no emotion about that comment. As you should. Did my playlist? I almost just. End? I think it did. Oh shit! You don't know how close I just came to dropping the queen. Uh, I feel no emotion upon this news. Emotion not felt. Well, I may, maybe I feel manka s, but I don't think that betrays too much strategically. Also, really, 
I think it says a lot when I describe my emotions via Twitch emotes. <clears throat> I would have loved to met let's one. Play, life. Let's play Queen A5. Queen to A5. Alright, it has been played. Uh, I That's what that's I should do to, where we want our queen. to my therapist. Um, you know, they'll just ask me, uh, how are you feeling? How's your week been? Uh, and I'll just open up with, man, it's just manka ass, you know? Dude, let's like just have prepare you to like mess with your therapist. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's like, ah, you don't get it, doc. <laughs> Sag, Madge, I've been molding all week. I was much younger. I uh, talked to a therapist like once, and I told him that I just hated triangles, and I had come up with this for no reason. And I was like, "The circles are so good, but I hate triangles." That, that's that's so toxic. <laughs> <laughs> I had no idea how to respond to that. So it's so unnecessary. Oh, that that's I I think that a younger me would have found that just so hilarious. Um, Older me is just concerned for you as a person. <laughs> I was like six, I don't know. Oh, wait, this is my oh, turn. Sorry, oh, shit, thinking. sorry. Oh, God, it got used to not playing. Um, oh, shit, wait, how do how do I... Anyone know how to play this game? Uh, I a think there's question. these things called pieces. And the one called the king, you typically want to move to the center. I don't believe you. Um, uh, it's maybe a good... Uh, thing to. Oh think. man. D A E. This game is hard. <laughs> Andre says, and the doctor is like another Papega patient. <laughs> Very good. Okay. Feel no emotions about this one. It's your move, so you are allowed to experience emotion if you desire. Well, I guess so. I choose to not. It's another thing I tell my therapist. No, it's an acceptable choice. All right, chat. Uh, the, the issue is this. There is now a queen staring down F7, uh, which is the reason that I d heavily dislike this opening. Um, is it, don't I have to play? What the fuck do I do here? Uh, hold on. Where does that queen go? C4. Okay, so it can't travel next turn. But and if it can travel after that, then I don't care, right? The only move here is like e3, right? Because I can't, like, if I play or sorry, e6. Because if I play bishop e6, uh, I mean that's good and all, but then it drops b6, and then I'm sad. Um, that's the reason that I really don't like queen a5. Um, I just do not. Ah, uh, I as e6 is it's like the only move, right? It's e6, right? There's like nothing else to do here, right? There's no other way to cover f7 or block f7. Uh, any move with the bishop, um, I mean, I, I guess I could block it with the queen, but actually I can't because how do I do that? It's It's got to be e6, right? e6 is like the only play. All right, we're going to play e6. Good talk, chat. Uh, all right, we're playing e6. I feel neither happy nor sad. <laughs> it's good to know.
I respect your apathy. Is respect an emotion? No. Okay. I guess it implies a set of emotions. Respect for the rules is following the rules and the rules forbid emotion. <laughs> or at least the expression of emotion. Therefore, respect is the lack of emotion. Wow. I think that was Socrates. Yeah, that, that's what you say to someone when they say uh, you don't show any emotion. Right, right, right. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah. Also, why I'm not in a relationship. <laughs> 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 Uh, I feel nothing about that. Me neither. I wonder what the average relationship status of the 5D chess player is. That is a good question. Hard to tell, right? Like, I think they have probably have more favorable demographics than, like, Twitch chat on average. Well, probably because on average they're older, so yeah. Oh, that's true. I just hear like that's a totally bunch of people true. talking, and then I forget that like. Yo, whose I'm in a turn voice is chat. it? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, it's right mine. Now, it's mine. Oh, okay, okay. okay. All right. Yep. Just, just making um, sure that we know whose turn yep. it is. All right. <laughs> you able to scroll out, Mage? Uh, yes. Just ask average human. Do a poll. I can do a poll. Wait, is this the song that Andre thought was a bop? Chat, I don't know how it is, but I always feel like I'm in such a terrible I don't position know if I'm allowed to. out of this opening. Uh, Probably can't say it. That what, what the fuck do I do here? Like now, uh, there's like a clear liability here on E6, right? Well. So like, how do I fucking cover that? Um, Bishop C4. Bishop C4! Okay. Oh, jeez. Alright. Uh, well, it's Smoke's turn. It's nice. Alternating turns is really nice, because I I only feel responsible, like, half the time. Maybe, I'm tweet, although I'm, I feel so doubly though. responsible the rest of the time. Right. So. Yeah, <laughs> so never mind. I'm going to screw it up for both of us. Nah, we, we screw up as a team. Average. I want to... Er, uh, smoke. I want to make that clear. Sorry, my chat just typed average. Uh, got my wires crossed. I I take it as a compliment. Because I <laughs> average human. Uh, okay, well that's good. Well, respect isn't an emotion, so um, I. Uh, right, we've established that respect I don't, is not I don't acknowledge. Emotion. Yeah. I, I I don't respect respect um, conceptually. That statement does not make me feel emotional either way. I can either agree nor disagree. I, I respect the lack of emotion. I like how Ryan Four said. Uh, Ryan Four asked like Queen B6. to justify. Wait. What, what did he just say? Qu queen b6? Is that what he said? Yes. All right. Queen b6 it is. I, we're only moving our queen now. Yeah. Is disrespect an emotion? <laughs> I think it is a medley of emotions, Andre. Well, if respect is the lack of emotions, then disrespect for the rules would mean uh, all of the emotions. Whoa. Or maybe it would just be the lack of the lack of emotions. So it'd be like moderate emotion. Well, the lack of a lack of emotion means some emotion, but not all emotion, right? 
Right. It would be like flagrant disrespect would be all emotion. <laughs> that checks out. I, I like how Lowe said there are alternatives. Ryan Four asked him to provide a single one, and then Lowe said, uh, I, 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 I'll DM you. Uh, trust me. Source, do just trust me. Uh, thanks, Los, for your insight. No, I don't know. I do feel like we're in a terrible position. Um, but I feel like I feel that all the time, man. Man, I feel like I'm watching... I feel liked I'm watching two therapists. I feel like I'm liable to play worse today because I'm more focused on making jokes than playing. Dude, I, listen, content is content, but also, uh, I, I have now been live for just about seven hours. Uh, so I, I, we're in it together I could, here. I could tell you were like, uh, losing your mind a little bit when, when you were getting ready to start this game. Oh yeah, dude. <laughs> what, what, what gave it away though? Uh, I don't remember, but I do remember <laughs> thinking based off that this man is losing his mind. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Dude, you should have seen me at this hour seven of last week when Sonoy introduced me to quantum chess and that's all we did for like six hours of stream or five maybe. Uh, I, I genuinely was like unable to put together sentences. It was it was bad. That sounds horrible. We, we should like schedule our matches ahead of time in the future. Yeah, you know, we really should. <laughs> uh, well, if we have any more matches to play. <laughs> um that we are in the losers bracket oh. so uh well yeah. okay so well, at least for the bracket we do there's the option to continue to play matches with other people who are out of the bracket uh so I if you want to do that um you know that sounds yeah. fun but it's up to you i don't know my schedule's getting a little tighter now the semester's starting so if we're out i, I might just that. say i'm done <laughs> yeah I, i'd respect that <laughs> It's tricky, and also, it's very tricky. <laughs> L Los is self-aware. Crazy says cement is in an existential crisis. Dude, it really is. Like, hour seven is where I go into deep existential crisis. Um, Man, I, real, I think I stream for, like, two hours at the most, because, like, then my, my voice, like, how do you even talk after seven hours? Well, that's my, no, it's eight hours is where my voice really starts getting stretchy. I mean, the real answer is hydrate. Uh, hydrate aggressively. I down so much water during the stream. Um, yeah. That's, that's most, also, it was way harder for me at the beginning. I think you kind of train yourself. You like build up vocal stamina, I feel. Or I feel like I definitely have. Um, I remember the first nine hour stream that I did when I was trying to figure out the, <laughs> it was right when the F7 crisis uh, sort of reared its ugly head. And I did like, oh, yeah, the I community, remember that. like, all right, everybody, let's try and figure out F7. Uh, and we just banged out like a shitload of theory. Um, I couldn't talk for like three days after that. It was bad. Uh, so I think it's just kind of, it's like anything else you sort of practice and and you uh and you gain resilience you know yeah our seven is when you start thinking about how you're going to defend your thesis even though you're a year away from having to do so yeah except i'm probably like th three years away uh which is even worse whose turn is it it is now uh mage's turn mage, mage just... knows that it's his turn right yep just it is my turn. Okay, okay. Just, just make it. I'm just deep in thought. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He's, he's in the rabbit hole. Yeah, yeah. Dude, he's just waiting for us to shut up so he can. He, he <laughs> is the rabbit hole. <laughs> Concentrate. <laughs> I, he, there's a deafen button on Discord. Yeah, there is. Yeah. <laughs> But the longer I think, the more it stresses my opponents out. They think I have. I'm not to. sure that it's true. Well, <laughs> the longer you think, the the less uh, lucid I become. Yeah, well, uh, we just get distracted. Yeah. And like forget what we were thinking, doing. So it's not yeah. a bad plan. Bad for content, uh, but not competitively. 
Dude, I gotta get through so many analyses. Dude, I started, I stopped and started the void match analysis like three times this stream. Yeah, when I, because I, I was gone for like a while, and then when I came back, you were analyzing the same game again. Like, <laughs> yeah, that's because oh, I got man. challenged by Alex Bay to um, Entanglement Chess, uh, which you should definitely check out a little bit later. Okay, uh, whose turn is this? Uh, my turn, right? Yeah, because yeah, you played yep. Queen B6. Okay, well, <laughs> I mean... All right, hold on. Got to give uh, a Sumet the... Well... The... Um, the... Yeah. Uh, the move. I gotta give Smith the move. Right, 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 right. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I truly wonder what Smith will play here. I. No the, spoilers. The thing is, that's how wondering. you know that it's seven hours into the stream. I will even second guess this move. Uh, but in the in the interest of time, I'm I'm just gonna play a takes b6. <laughs> oh, good it. job. You you got us a queen. Uh, you, you, no communication, yeah. smoke. Maybe oh, I didn't I'm notice sorry. that. I, I, I didn't mean that I felt any emotion. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. I, I, felt I, I might not have been aware. You know. Crazy says next stream, Summit plays five D chess in REM sleep. Uh, I don't. Well, probably it'll take REM sleep. Are you having uh, a lucid dream right now? It's possible. The first Dude, night. I had the wildest fucking dream. Two days ago, I had the craziest, like, Inception style many dreams within dreams, where I kept, like, falling asleep in my dream and then, like, having another dream and then another one and then waking up from the dreams, like, and then being at the same place where I was when I went asleep in the dreams. And sometimes there was, like, lateral movement between dreams. And I had the most, it was crazy. There was like a 0.5th <laughs> layer dream between being awake um, where I felt like I was in my bed, but I had the most real- What'd you say, Neith? <laughs> Mage, you able to scroll out for a half second? Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Uh, let, yeah. Uh, let, let me let me mute here. <laughs> it's uh, like the dream's getting intensified. Man. All right, yeah, okay. Yeah. I, I muted and deafened. Stream, like I genuinely, I. And there was like the layer where I was awake and it felt like for one of the times when I was waking up, I kept going out all of the way till I like forced myself awake to be like, okay, I need to know like which layer of reality this is. Like I need to wake up and I kept waking up and then I got to the end. But right as I got to the end, it really seriously felt like, I, like the first time it felt like my parents were in my room. I don't live, I live eight hours away from where my parents live. Uh, and it felt like my, I had like my parents had like one hand on my back, one hand on my chest, like lifting me out of bed. Like I felt this and I heard their voice and I was like, oh shit. Like, I don't know where I am. I know that this is the real world, but my parents are here, which must mean they're not supposed to be here. So like, I must've gotten into an accident and like, I don't know where I am. Uh, but I know that they're here and that's like the only way that it makes sense is if there is like an emergency and they're pulling me out of bed and I don't feel like I can move my body so I must be like in a coma or something but then I just sort of like woke up from that and I was like okay I'm definitely awake now and so I was even when I woke up I wasn't sure that I woke up and there was another t like the next time so I like dove in a few layers deep again did some lateral moves went back all the way up and I like very 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 intensely felt like my girlfriend's presence next to me in the bed saying stuff and she doesn't live like where I live she lives somewhere else too and she wasn't with me that night so I was like whoa like what what happened like was I again was there an accident like I thought last time but that didn't happen last time probably didn't happen this time so maybe I just like I have amnesia from like last night or maybe like the last night the whole previous day was a dream or like all of my experiences up until the last time she was in my bed was a dream. And then I like slowly gained like consciousness out of that. And I was like, okay, like I'm definitely awake now. And I, but I was so rattled. It, it was insane. like, I've never in my life had as crazy, like off putting intense, jarring experience like this. Like it was absolutely absurd. I, I was like, I was really shaken up. Like that must be the type of like reality warped definition feelings that you have 
when you're like under the influence of psychedelic substances like even the dreams themselves were also intensely real like i real. i also have i have like some amount of um what, what's the word for when you uh uh aphoria is that what it's called dysphoria no it's the th i can't like visualize things very concretely in my head like it's all nebulous colors and concepts and shapes in my brain like i can't really like visualize stuff dysphoria is that what that's called i don't remember uh anyway it's not so even in my dreams it's like always a haze and i can't really like remember stuff it's like really crazy well i mean that's just the way that my brain is so i'm used to it um but these dreams man i'm telling you i was having like intense i don't think they should have traded queens here by the way right because then all of the liability is gone for... Oh, then again, it's difficult for me to defend F7 another time. What do I... How do we defend... E6 is like a real issue here, but what can I do about that? I... Next turn, it's Smoke's turn, right? Maybe you can play Bishop D6. Sorry, I got distracted. F A Fantasia, that's the one. Yes, I believe that's the word. Thank you. Um, I have some form of that, but these dreams were like, I could so clearly see the pictures and that's never happened in my brain before. So there was like the extra layer of, in addition to the inception style stuff, I was like, this must be reality because I like it. I can see things like there, but it can't be because like contextually there was like some wacky shit going on. Uh, like in some of the layers, there was some like i was also on oh, the other thing right fuck dude i'm telling you this was like a crazy experience i in my dreams i always have like spatially i i have like a fix i i think i have a sort of synesthesia that relates to spaces in some way because i always like in my mind this is like partially a neuroatypicality thing it's like an adhd type of thing but in my head i have these concepts of spaces that i sort of retrace constantly like in my in my brain i'll always be if i'm like bored or not doing anything or like in bed trying to fall asleep or like on the phone i like constantly retrace through it's like that microsoft screensaver while you're moving through the maze like that type of movement but in like a real space that i have occupied in my life and i know like my childhood housing complex uh like the one that the one that i used to live in or like an old school or like a like a childhood friend's house like i'll just constantly move through the space like i'll be pacing but in my mind in the space and so spaces are like very you know i i just have these like spaces that are sort of etched into my mind uh, spaces are important to me and in all of my dreams, I usually have, it's very rare that I will have like a new location added to my dream repertoire, including the fake ones. Uh, I Like I'll, in my dreams, I will have made up spaces that don't actually exist, but that I'll go back to consistently. There'll be like repeats. It'll be like one of many locations and there are, I have like three or four that I can pull up in my mind's eye vaguely again, cause I, I, I have aphantasia or some, sort of that uh and so it's like you know like once every many many sleeps i'll have like a new space come up and i'll be like whoa i just added like i just synthesized like a new space a new physical like space into my brain into my dreams uh <laughs> but for these dreams, all of these on top of everything, like the crazy Inception style falling asleep and the crazy like anti aphantasia where everything was like really real and sensational and like really felt real and the waking up and I me feeling in my bed that like shit was going on. I like all of the locations were new, like all of them. So it was like extra super trippy. It was like, what just happened? And I don't know if I'm visiting any of those locations again in my dreams all right uh because it hasn't been that long since okay this is a good stopping off point but crazy fucking shit man okay all right good timing i just finished an insane uh anecdote uh what are we doing here fam <laughs> what's what's going down i was about I'm to say good. 
that I'm sure glad this is Samet's problem, but it's actually not. It's, my it's, problem. it's not, unfortunately. Yeah, it's your problem. Yeah. Uh, sorry, man. I have, to, I have to let you think. Actually, I don't have to think. <laughs> I, I feel no particular way about that. Me neither. <laughs> well, I'm glad we're on the same page. Bro, I'd like to have these fixed locations in my dreams. New location lock. Dude, that's how it feels sometimes, man. It's crazy. Dude, these dreams. 5D dreams with multiverse time travel. Yeah, that, that's how it feels, sort of. Uh, maybe we're in Samet's dream and nothing is real. Who knows, maybe 5D chess is just a construct of Samet's imagination. Dude, I swear, it, it could be. It could be. Um, I won't go into that. Okay, Samet's really having an existential crisis now. My father told me he dreamt that aliens were trying to abduct him through the window. Then he woke up and aliens tried to abduct <clears> him again. <throat> That's happened to me, not with aliens, but with the tornado. <laughs> Sp <laughs> Spontaneously forming in my dreams. That has happened to me. Um, where I like, there was a tornado that I saw from my room and it was like about it's to been a good take my- chest day. It was crazy. And then I woke up and I went downstairs in my house. It I was like, dude, I, I told Every my parents, I was like, this day. this has been the craziest but like, this one, dream where like a tornado was like forming in my room and the, in, in like our house and it was gonna like take the house away. And then they like pointed out the window and they were like, you mean that? And I was like, what the Hopefully we fuck? win this game. You know, dude. Well, I really say, fucked me. And then I woke up win. and I was shook. I was like, um, confidence, sir. Yeah, confidence and it took me key. like a few hours yeah, yeah. to be like, I don't want to. All right, I think we're safe. Start wanting to do uh, no spontaneous time, tornadoes so. forming in my yard, which isn't even. It's not I'm, a place like, where tornadoes like happen. Like, like it's strategy thing. I mean, you like, know, like West Virginia, uh, like surrounded by hills. It's just not a thing that happens. So, yeah. Um, what's happened to me? Um, holy oh, I, shit, I, man. I uh, haven't calculated this very deep, but we're going to take the night because it's free. <laughs> uh, no commentary, please. So do you mean uh, C takes B5? Yes. Triple pawn? Yes. We're one pawn oh, away from advanced pawns. connect four. Let's go. All right. We <laughs> might not win 5D chess, but we're going to win But we're going to win tic-tac-toe. Win 5D chess in your heart. The true 5D chess was the tic-tac-toe we played along the way. Well, okay, I guess he's also won tic-tac- No, because you don't win connect four by default, so that doesn't count. Never mind. We, we definitely won tic-tac-toe. Um, but if I, like, connect four here, does that- well, I can't get uh, any moves stretching. But how? Stuff. That's illegal. Well, like, I don't think it's uh, don't think your color multicolored connected. Oh, that's in, dude. If, well, okay, that doesn't make sense. <laughs> no, I was gonna, I was gonna say what if, but I don't think that makes any sense for any game. Uh, I don't think it works. How do you know this is not a dream loss? Um. If I'm streaming in my dream, that's pretty sad. Not gonna lie. <laughs> I mean, there, there are better uses of not my real lifetime, but certainly at least my like imaginary mental time. I like to think. Whoa, that's check. Commentary. Not called for. Fuck. Yeah. <laughs> well, no, it's my turn, right? Or right, wait, is yeah. it? Yeah, it is. Okay. But I mean, yeah. still. That's... No, you're, you're right. You're right. Maybe computer what? smoke didn't see that as a check. It's true. Right. right. What if I didn't know that was a check? Right. You're right. Resented. I apologize. Yep. Um. I feel no emotion. About what the fuck is that. happening? Wow, the timer really does fuck with your. Holy shit. Okay. Oh wait, I can't. Can, I can, can you this. believe that this is turn ten? What? <laughs> Bro. Wow, we're so far ahead in time. Okay, I feel pretty good about that. Hey, don't. Alright, don't hey, take hey, that hey, as meaning. That's strategic dis discussion, oh, man. Sorry. Whoa. Hey, am I allowed to tell my partner to play faster? Uh, yeah. I think that's strategic. 
<laughs> I, I, I won't do it then. I think that's actually like uh, pretty strategic. Uh, I, you, you are right. <clears throat> All right. Let, let me. Let me. Um. Oh, let me mute. All right, chat. What the fuck? How do I play this game? Uh. Hold on. What am? Okay. My. Our. Bishop is pretty sad. What what is happening here in this game? I mean, they've got a better pawn structure. We have opened up the... Sp okay. Well, I could connect the knights here, but then my bishop is sad. Uh, what are my alternatives? I don't really like bishop d7 because I feel like keeping the bishop pair... Then again, our bishop is much better developed than his bishop is. Um, what is... I feel like I should be concerned. I don't want to blow. I want my bishop, I think, to continue to defend. I think I want my bishop to continue to defend e6, right? Uh, I think that probably blocking with the knight on. Yeah, no, right? I th knight c6 must be the best move, right? I mean, we do have the follow up. Rook a5, which feels pretty good, if because if he wanted trades in, if he wants to trade in, I'm pretty happy about that. What do we do with the... Ah, uh, whatever, if we lose, fuck it. I need to end stream. <laughs> I need this game to be over before 10.30 p.m. Eastern time. Okay. Uh, all right. We're going to play knight c6. Uh, I respect your move, but that uh, does not. Wow. Which means I still have no emotion about it. Yeah, that's true. Imagine streaming in dreams for other dreaming people. I don't know what's sadder, being the person streaming in your dream or being the person in your dream watching me stream. <laughs> uh, streaming to I imaginary mean, watch... random names in an imaginary page called Twitch being found in your subconscious too deep by the way for getting existential says andre and um, is that it is that the entirety of that statement because that's kind of brilliant uh in some way well, what were you about to say smoke I, I feel like if someone's dreaming about you streaming in their sleep it's not necessarily sad so much as it is like concern potentially concerning for you <laughs> like concerning that, that, for both that, of us that probably. Into the it's like, stay in their dreams. Well, I, I think Andre's statement was more existential before he added the second statement. <laughs> yeah. Holy shit. Are, are you guys Eastern time? Are we all Eastern time in here? No, no. Uh, Smoke is Central, I'm Central. Right? Yeah, I'm from Minnesota. Oh, Minnesota. What, are, are you are you in Minnesota? My girlfriend's from Minnesota. Uh, where in? Um, Twin Cities or somewhere else? Yeah, around there. I'm actually in Iowa right now for school. But... Okay, I was gonna ask if you're uh, home for, or if you're at school or if you're home. Mage Neath, are, are you guys Eastern? Eastern. Yes. Word. Eastern. So we're all around the same time. Yeah. But I mean it, like, what makes reality real? I think that question. You know what I mean? Uh, actually, to the, whoever asked that question, you're, no, no one else is going to tell you this because they're all simulated not to. But you're the <laughs> only brain in the you, You're the only one forever. I, I'm, I'm context too. All of us, the rest of us, we're all just computer but, generated. But why would you, you are the why brain would in the you vet. say that? Uh, it's a bug. <laughs> <laughs> but it could just as well be a bug. Like, I, I don't know. I, I'm unconvinced. Bro, it's so all hard right, to well, communicate. All right. The listener, you know you're real because you have a conscious thought. You can think, so you know. But everyone uh, else, they're just making it. I'm telling you. Neith, it's your turn, right? I'm just yep, yeah. forgetful. Okay. 
yeah, I'm yeah. also real, I'm by the making... way. It's just the two of us. I'm just double checking. Yep. Uh, right now the Blitz tourney has 15 participants. It's pretty hey, good. Hey, that's exciting. <laughs> Almost a full bracket. Che cheeky little plug for the Blitz tourney. <laughs> yes, Very it's nice. a little slight plug. <laughs> your plug is welcome I, I hope to see a lot of participants i think i think it could be really fun looking forward bishop to it c4. Uh, i know i'm kind of real bishop c4 the thing is you're as real as you need to be you know what i mean like i think that asking that quest like the ability to ask that question is sufficient reality because i mean that's how i think if i if i think like because i've thought like okay am i in the truman show or whatever and my response is kind of, if I am, so what? Like, yeah, I just have to, I can't be expected by any of the viewers of the Truman Show to not believe that life isn't real, you know? Like, I don't care who, what am I being judged by like the existential voyeur? I don't, you know, it's just like, you just got to keep living your life, man. The thumbnail must be Smet waking up over and over again. I don't know how I make that a thumbnail. Uh maybe hard to convey in a thumbnail uh, but, uh i'm so glad that this isn't my turn <laughs> uh wait it's yeah, not right I'm, okay yeah yeah it's, it's i'm i'm trying to count it's not easy uh i'm gonna finish my muffin go wild i feel nothing about your um your counting yeah well i let me know if i have to <laughs> zoom <laughs> Fine, I will. <laughs> Sorry, I I didn't mean to uh, express emotion there. That was an emotion, was it? No, it certainly wasn't. <laughs> I feel that. That's not an emotion, right? Mm hmm Acceptable. Consent is not an emotion. I'm just gonna leave that one out there. Muffin done. This is a good muffin. Anyone else sometime wait, let me let me mute for this. Sorry, sorry, smoke. Wait, I can't mute for this. Oh I can mute, but yeah, not definitely. Just, in my just get ready for this blunder. <laughs> right. Actually. Okay. Anyone else ever just like go through life? <laughs> I love how long games like this end up just being like a podcast or like a forum for me to just talk about whatever. Anyone else just do something incredibly mundane and become overwhelmed with like a feeling of privilege or blessedness? I, I just ate that muffin live on stream and I just felt, damn, fucking hashtag blessed, man. I'm out here eating muffins. You know what I mean? Like the muffin felt a little dry. And, and I thought that consciously as I was eating the chocolate chip muffin. How fucking privileged is that, dude? I mean, I know that experience is relative, but sometimes you just gotta, you just gotta feel like hashtag blessed unironically sometimes, man. You know what I mean? Just holy shit. I'm eating muffins out here. <laughs> Did you know what I mean? <laughs> Any, anyone been in that muffin eating <clears throat> kind of world? Just me? Oh, what a status of privilege. I mean, like, if reincarnation is a thing, which I personally don't believe, but you know, as like a, as a thought experiment here, what are the odds that you're going to be eating muffins when you come back? You know? I don't know where I'm going with this. 
for seven and a half hours in the stream. <laughs> I still have analysis to finish. I don't know. All I'm gonna say is I should have coughed three times at the start of the match. <laughs> yeah. Uh. I didn't do it quick enough. Sorry. Sorry. Said a seven and a half hour mark. <laughs> Sorry. I get a little gassy in the evenings. <laughs> I mean, if I'm a fly, if you're a fly, you don't know what the fuck you're eating, right? Like, if I'm a fly, I might, I don't know if this is true, but, like, shit attracts more flies than, than muffins, so I might enjoy a shit more than I enjoy a muffin. Then again, I guess I wouldn't know what I'm missing if I was a fly, right? I mean, I don't know the range of uh, we're catharsis that a, that a fly experiences. Um, maybe it's superior, I don't know. Did you uh, catch that one? Okay, okay, sorry. What, 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 what? Knight e4. Uh, knight e4, like this move right here on the screen? Yeah. Just making sure I... Okay, now coughing through times the possibility. That's why I played, I mean... <laughs> I feel uh, much. Is it my turn? Yes. Do they have to be yes. consecutive? Okay, uh, actually, we didn't room. specify. Shit. No, we should... Went over that. It might be up to my interpretation. Oh, uh, that was a critical oversight, wasn't it? Only if he chooses to cough three times non-consecutively. I've always said, um, non-consecutive coughs, coughs, um, are, are resolute coughs. I, I don't know what that means. <clears throat> what, what the fuck is this music? It's, I feel like I'm... Like, who am I thinking of? What's like the detective show? Where the... Oh, shit. Uh, Detective Gadget? No, that's Inspector Gadget. Oh. Wait, aren't they like the same thing, though? No? Uh... No? Yes? No? I don't know. I, I think he's never specified man. what he's inspecting. You can you can have their inspectors for like construction sites and shit. You know what I mean? Or like, yeah, but he's got a detective's hat. Do you think he just like killed a detective? I, his you hat? can buy those hats. Oh, <laughs> I mean, he's also got like a punching glove on like a you know accordion. Like, oh, do you think the hat is can... one of his gadgets? You know, I don't know. <laughs> I guess not. I don't think the. Well, what's a gadget? How do you I define I think by gadget? definition, every hat is a gadget. Is it though? Okay, gadget definition. Ah, oh, shit, I hear a travel. All right. Uh, a oh, small yeah, mechanical coming. or electronic device or tool, especially an ingenious or novel one. That's Your aw crap is. timed up perfectly with the audio sound I have of travels. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit, here we go again. Whoa. The fuck? I feel no emotion, but whose turn is it? Oh, it's, it's your turn. Ah, shit. You feel emotion. I suddenly emotion. feel emotion. <laughs> oh, fuck me. Okay. All right. <sighs> fuck this, man. On the bright side, this is like the amount of time you would get for an entire game in a medium timer, so. True. Well, plus the extra, um. 16 seconds. Six increment. seconds of increment. Yes. Yeah. Take those six seconds to the bank, man. I, I need to go to the think tank. I'm gonna mute and deafen. Cool. All right. What the fuck, chat? What? What's what? How is this even possible? Oh, god, that sucks. It wouldn't have been possible next turn too. It's because we put the knight there. So this is like the only turn that's possible. Okay, hold on. We can probably pull something crazy out, right? 
Like with some wacky, some, some whack ass travels, yeah? Okay, what's the furthest back that we can go? Can we go further back? Oh, we can! Oh no, I wanted to go one turn further back so that I could grab that bishop with the knight, but that's not how the game works. Although, no, because I need these guys. I don't want to give them a free queen. We, we have two... Oh, we don't have any queens. Fuck me. Alright, what am I worried about here? Everything. Oh, this is so bad for me. I don't think I exile a king, do I? I could. That feels bad for me. Bro, don't panic. You're right. You're right. I shouldn't panic. I shouldn't panic. Okay, what's actually happening here? Well, the quest, the, there's a bit of an issue with the fact that there are, there are three pieces that are all staring down E6, right? If I take here, then take here, takes, takes is mate. So I can't do that. Can't do that. How, how does play game? How do I, what do I do here? I mean, a knight out here doesn't add an extra defender, but it takes away an attacker. But then like check happens. Do I need to, I think I need to exile here, right? Am I wrong? Queen d8 doesn't work. Not the least of which because queen b7 happens. Man, he took our light square bishop, which was the second defender. Where where does this go? Bro, all these travels suck. Okay, hold on. I don't want to... Is there... What can I do? I guess bishop here solves all my issues, right? Sort of? Does it? Bishop here, then what? Takes, takes? Well, then I'm checked, right? Or... Bishop here. Okay, what what are my exile options? No, I can't exile because this bishop will actually attack my king on e8 down on the second timeline because there's nothing on d8 here. I guess I go here. That's such a problem though because like if I go here and then I go here or something then like... Like, like, okay, here, and then, like, takes. And then, like, takes, and then this is an issue, because then this is checking, right? And so how do I... How do I play this game? Okay, here. And then I can play bishop up. Like, here. And then this happens, and then this happens. But then the bishop takes on f7, right? Andre told me not to panic, but I'm panicking. How many turns in the past was that? Oh, that's like five turns in the past. This is bullshit. Well, it's only four. So this bishop and this pawn will defend themselves. So I, I have that to remember. If I go queen d8, then as soon as these shenanigans happen, then I can go bishop out. And then this check happens. Okay, so... Um, queen d8. Oh, 
Okay, you can panic. <laughs> okay, wait. Queen d8. Queen d8. Bishop takes e6. <coughs> Alhamdulillah, I'm just kidding. Um, bishop out. Bishop takes f7. And that's too far away. Not like this, lol w. <laughs> or just that's just lol not lol w this is a problem we've got two whole timelines to work with though right i'm like one turn off is the problem this is where I can recapture, right? Oh, I don't have the brain for this right now. I think realistically, the only way out here, whatever, let's just play queen d8, see what happens. Uh, all right, hello, uh, is, is anyone here? Yep. Yep. Yeah. Okay. It's your move. Oh. Queen d8, locked in. All right, zoom in. Yep, yep, yep. So, endorphins get released when you have a positive emotion. Well, it gets released when you have a negative one, because neither of those have been released in my mind. <laughs> I think it depends. I think it depends on your emotion. Could be like, I don't know, cortisol? Adrenaline? No, like, I feel like adrenaline's kind of a positive emotion, though. Do you? I, I think that says something about you. Uh, Certainly, I mean, cortisol is probably negative. That's like stress, right? Prefix-wise, I want to say like exorphins. Maybe they probably. <laughs> that's not I a thing. That's how, <laughs> I don't think that's how it works. I don't know. Endo. It would be ex. Yeah, exorphins. I don't know. Yeah, uh, I mean, I epinephrine. I think, right? Uh, as well, a lot of people like adrenaline. Yeah. When you start seeing each piece in superposition, bruh. <laughs> Get ready for me to quantum split my queens everywhere. Oh, dude, I'm, I'm done with I have about chess. like a 25% chance of winning this. I don't like it. Why would I play 5D if I didn't like adrenaline? <laughs> I think quantum fair, chess fair is point. sleeping on uh, F sacking. Like I think if they allowed quantum captures, it would be interesting. Well, if they allowed quantum captures, you could go absolute. I don't understand why merge captures aren't allowed. That makes absolutely no sense to me. Yeah. Merge captures, maybe uh, quantum like splitting captures. Those would make it really interesting. Maybe a bit okay, like- Okay, quantum splitting captures feels like it'd be imbalanced. Uh... Uh, I think the bigger problem with it is I don't know how you do UI for it. That's why I feel like uh... they didn't do it. Because you have a piece that may or may not be on that square. Like if you uh, well, split no, it's, to take uh, a pawn. It's easy. You just do it the same way that you would do normally. For UI. Like you just hold the two targets. It's just instead of targets that are unoccupied, you can also yeah, choose targets that but, are occupied. But you don't, but that pawn's still there. So the, the opponent needs to be able to push their pawn. And you need to be able to move your knight on that square because both are possibilities that occupy the same no, square. No, a split must be... You, you can't split on a pawn capture and not also move ahead one square, right? I don't think that would be kosher. I mean... Uh, what I appreciate about this, by the way, is that... Um, is that mage traveled to an even number Oh, wait, turn. it's my turn, right? Uh, no, it's my turn. It's, no, it's oh, my turn. Okay. Yeah, mage travel to an even number turn, so we've preserved the even odd turn order. 
Yeah. Based. Virgin Quantum Chess versus Chad Entanglement Chess. I I really had a lot of fun with Entanglement Chess. I can't believe we didn't finish that Bond Cloud game though. That was insane. <clears throat> I was really surprised when the king started uh, forcing things to be at night. It makes, it makes sense. sense. Yeah, just so wacky. Yeah, the king has. It's really interesting. It's so interesting. Oh, it was. Yeah, I should have. There was that one get Ryan for CEO pointed out that the first game I could have forced one of his queens or bishops to be a bishop for sure. Um, mm -hmm. But the the turn after I realized Alex Bay moved it in such a way that it was a queen. Bond Cloud Infinity, it's fucking ridiculous, dude. It's hard to mate that thing. Uh, it, it's rough, man. And then your opponent has like all of his pieces. It's kind of crazy. Like, it's well, such an can't... asset and a liability uh, to, like, have pieces undefined. It's really interesting. They couldn't, uh, like, they can't measure, like, your, your pieces can't change from how you move them on your turn, right? They can only change yes. what your pieces are, like, on their turn with their king. No, I, I don't mean, know if that makes sense with what I'm saying. I mean, you no, you can move in a way that defines what your piece is, right? Yeah, what I mean is like if for when you're promoting the pawns, yeah, uh, you promoted and then it was uh, Wait, like his turn. Yep. Uh, what was the move? I uh, zoom out. Zoom out. Gotcha. Yeah. This good. Yep. Dude, the the okay. pawn promotion really fucking got me though. <laughs> but like, if you promote your pawn, yeah, and then Alex Bay moves next to it, that allows him to uh, like sort of measure it. Yeah, yeah, to force it and to be at least... It, it, it excludes if you put it. him in check, though, with the... Or, like, maybe not really check, but you just place the thing right next to it. Yeah, uh, that, that forces it to be... Well, I mean, it depends on how you move. Uh, mm -hmm. Right? Like, how the moving next to it happens. Like, if he moves diagonally adjacent, that means that it can't be a queen or bishop, so it's rook or knight. But then I, if you I was thinking that... Over, once you promote, you could force it to be, like, a certain piece, because it would check the king, but that's not how it works. There's no way to measure it off of the instant that um it gets promoted. No, that's for sure. Yeah. Because if, like, you promote yeah, cause, cause it, because you know it depends check, on how his but... king moves. Because if his king, like, is would be in check, and then it moves in such a way that it still would be in check on your next turn, then it can't be any of the kind of pieces that... Yeah. Yeah, etc. It's interesting that after a queen promo after a pawn promotion, you need at least two more turns to be able to make it a queen. Um, it's like hardest to make it a yeah. queen of any of the pieces. That's kind of cool. What a wild game. Yeah, if you could only promote to a queen and a bishop, uh then, for example, like, diagonal checks would instantly be a check. They can't force it to be anything. Oh, yeah, but you can. Or That's what I was thinking, but I guess it's already sort of that piece anyway. So it's the it track. Bro, I don't even like it anymore. Oh, my God. All right. All right. Um, this is the track, Andre. Bishop takes also, E6. Yes. Uh, I was just going to say, be careful with your notation here. Yep. Uh, track so, oh, which yes. one? C, Bishop. No, that doesn't help. <laughs> that, uh, you have to. <laughs> it's it's bishop eight takes e six or bishop four takes d bishop e6. four takes e six. Okay. <laughs> uh, what do you say? Yeah. See it, then you're like, oh wait, no, that doesn't even work. Be, one of the rare situations where you have to be extremely exact on your notation. <laughs> I mean, it's not too well, exact. It's it's more the fact that you have to use the numerical. Yeah. Okay, so instead yeah, of C. The... <laughs> you All don't right. have to be exact, you just have to be down to the um, file or rank.
Smoke, it's your move. Just letting you know. Yeah, um, instead of thinking, we're just going to play Bishop E7. <laughs> okay. Okay. I see it's, it is my job to figure out what the fuck is happening. <laughs> Obviously. All right, I'll take it. It can only be your job. feel when you're not the team flagging uh let's try to win on time i can't tell that i can't verbally communicate that to smoke but i'm hoping i'm hoping that he realizes what the time looks like then again he's the one who just it doesn't give a fuck i really i honestly don't know how we respond to bishop takes f7 here um i i think we have to exile the king right uh or we have to do a travel here probably with this bishop where are we doing the travel? Probably to C5, but then what's the follow-up? Who the fuck knows, man? I mean, that does gear up for like a recapture. I feel bad with every move. <laughs> every time that I take up time, it's just time taken away from well, me. But, but actually, it doesn't really work lie. because the bishop... <laughs> don't worry, don't worry. Here is going to... Oh, I'm both doing of the exact these bishops are going to check our king. I think we lose, man. <laughs> I'm going to leave you with one second We're, and blame you when we lose. We are one turn away... <laughs> Uh, we are worry. one turn away I'm from calculated. all of these pieces defending yeah, like there's 16 I, I, bonus I, seconds why would you lose um, off one second yeah 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 yeah. can't lose <laughs> off one second it, impossible it's so close but it's not is there impossible, can we win i tell you anyone know how we win uh the problem is that this bishop only just traveled so we don't even have a man i'm mad I know how you win smiley face. All right, Ryan four, calm down. Uh, okay. Okay. Well, of move. course that's the move we have to play. Okay. Now we he figure out what the move. fuck we do. <clears throat> Hold on. It's now Samet's term. Term. Turn. Honestly, do we play? Is this insane? Tell me if this is insane, chat. I mean, don't actually. Is it Smets or is it mine? Um, uh, I believe it's, 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 it's my yeah, turn because you said Bishop E7. Yeah, I don't want to deal with this. Yeah, yeah, I know. I feel you. Okay, so I think maybe King F8? Is that crazy? Is King F8 crazy? I don't know if King F8 is crazy. Am I suspecting what you're suspecting? <clears throat> is King F8 uh, crazy? Because what do we do? Because uh, then I can recapture with the pawn. Not yet. He doesn't have any other check to deliver. Right? Uh. Okay. King F8... King, King F8 might be... Is that just crazy? <laughs> I, I don't know. I think King F8, I think, is a... Is an option... What else do I do? Is there a way that I can win here on this board? Well, okay, I have to survive, but can I travel? Okay, none of these travels are sufficient to actually do anything with that side of the board, right? Um, so that's not that's not like a thing. Uh, the, the only real travel that I have is definitely with this bishop. Um, <laughs> this music is absurd, by the way. Uh, but if, if, if I, no, I can't do this because then the bishop up there will be checking my king down here and that's just not cool, right? Okay, what are my other options? Uh, my other options are to exile this king, but I don't want to waste a timeline on that. But do I have an option? Okay, so I mean, I can't ever move it here because then there's the knight immediate mate. Wait, that's not mate though. Okay, obviously can't move it onto this board because I'm in check. I could maybe move it onto like this board or something. Um... And then, 
uh, like this check here doesn't work because, but again, then I've got the same issue with this bishop. Is this, do we king f8 here? Do we king f8? <laughs> Chat, is this real life? We're gonna king f8. Uh, all right, I'm gonna play king f8 here. Hello? Okay. Still no emotion. I don't think you have to say them. Oh, well, you're probably just alerting computers. Uh, I, I'm, just, I'm just alerting you guys. Yep. Yeah, 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 fair. No, no, you have to fair. alert me because I'm playing on my phone. Okay, I need your turn. All right, you, you, you figure it out, Smoke. It's like hot oh, yeah, potato, okay. five-dimensional hot potato is what we're playing right now. <laughs> yeah, whoever's turn it is when uh, someone gets checkmated, which uh, may or may not be us, is that's whose fault it is. Yeah, 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 yeah. So just try to time it so it's not you. <laughs> Magnum PI. I think that's who I was thinking of earlier. Like G5. Or actually, hold up. <laughs> uh, hello, sir? We haven't played it yet. Uh... I mean, you haven't. Yeah, I... Uh, simultaneously, uh, yeah. All right, go for knight g5. All right. Yeah. Cool. Now it's smoke. I will push uh -huh. this button as it is being offered by the UI. Bro, do we survive this? I muted. D <laughs> Was this the move? <laughs> Because now we play with the pawn and I then... I barely even know why we're not in me right now. <laughs> <laughs> I do know it. I just... Because then we're, then it's defended by the bishop, right? I think we're fine. Maybe? But how do we win? Wait, we can travel next turn. <gasps> Wait, do we win? <gasps> do we win in a turn? <gasps> Guys. <laughs> Sorry. I, uh, I'm freaking out. Dude, it's eight hours into stream. Can you blame me? What a crazy fucking game. All right. Um, <clears throat> all right. And be right back. Sure. If this was like a digital format, it would be so cool to have like, uh, like rather than saying the moves, you can just like, it goes like each player alternating, but you can also pre-move. So while your opponents, like, or while your uh, teammates thinking you're pre-moving like your move or something. Yeah. Or, well, maybe not your move, but like while you're the next person is moving. All right, we're just gonna play F takes F seven. Uh, I, I'm I'm guessing you mean the only F takes F seven that is possible. Uh, no, I meant the impossible one. Uh, okay, then I'm gonna need you to clarify. Time to cheat. It's time to cheat. <laughs> All right, GXXX. Uh, this is the this this is why I time to shine. Urged him to look into the memory editing. Um applications yep. okay so so this is the move just to be completely explicit yes oh uh, yeah all right alex space says oh god pre-move sounds like a nightmare to try to implement wait it's my turn right yes it's my turn correct uh yeah yeah because right? okay, it's moves, even so it's right yeah okay yep all right Mm. Okay. Guys, I think we just lost, right? Because mm. it's not our turn on the other board, so we just lose here, right? I, I got I think, four and a half minutes. I think we just lost. I'm just kidding. Nah. Right? It didn't work. Hey. I was thinking night takes, because the night takes. Sometimes I doubt lose. myself, okay? 
The 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 queen takes definitely takes. You saw that right? game with right and wrong. I don't yeah, want that we again. We definitely lose, right? I, okay, I, okay, good game. All right, GG. I, I was about to swear on the soul of my father that it was a uh, checkmate. You yeah, just it. it's it, it is. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, we had so many pieces covering. <laughs> I, it was I, my fault too. It's ours. I don't. Was it? How? Like what? Um. No, we we chose. This was hot potato. Uh, I lost. Oh I yeah, so, no, it's your fault. <laughs> props I, I was so. The, Props to I me was for so actually having the balls to go for this. Because uh, I was yeah. looking at it, and like this honest, travel, like, he this plays, worked. Yeah, I Neath this plays worked. Knight B5, sacking the knight, which I was looking at, and I'm like, God, he's a madman. <laughs> knight but, B5, sure. sacking the knight? Oh, yeah, 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 I got you. Yeah, yeah, no, it was, a, it, was a, it was a Trojan knight, for sure. Or a Greek gift, I guess, Greek knight. Yeah. Um, yeah. I, guess, I guess the Trojan horse... Was a Greek knight? A Greek horse, at least? All right, anyway. Uh, no, I mean, the fact that this bishop... I, I don't even know that there was any risk associated with that move. Because, um, oh, like, the fact I, that I, you I take with this travel the, the bishop that defends e6 uh, is, like, G-fucking-G, G, man. <laughs> like, there's... I mean, yeah, we were uh, one turn off of I, everything being pretty well defended, uh, but one turn isn't enough. And the... Uh, turn that we could have traveled to um was i don't think there was anything i i think maybe uh sh i don't know it can't really exile the king because there's nothing on either e7 or d8 uh on the middle timeline so this bishop is going to yeah yeah well i guess what yeah. we could have done is i could have made a buffer timeline uh and then exiled the king uh which would have worked um, yeah, but then it would have bought us a That time gives us double tra turn. double travels with a position. You could have also that moved like the king that. after That's true. exiling or something. Uh, no, I don't think that works well as long as we have a check. By the way, is this? Um, I, I saw Andre and Ryan for CEO said uh, that they had some ideas. Uh, w was this your idea or did you have other ideas? How do you survive this? Uh, we got really yeah. wrecked. I mean, in fairness, Smoke, I would also have grabbed that bishop because. <laughs> Yeah. I, I can't be sat here. The, eight the hours way into I was calculating. calculating. Yeah, the way I calculated uh, was that I, like, I've done this travel a few times. Uh, a similar yeah, travel. We oh, looked okay. at similar travels, but nothing quite as like it was pretty far off from this. I'm surprised we coordinated this as well between the both of us, not going into this with like this line prepped or anything. For real, that was fantastic. Effectively, my only prep was. I knew that knight b5 exposes this, and by yeah. allowing this, I was thinking, you know what? I think it might actually work. Dude, but it, See, so if... have you played enough games to realize that, like, queen trade and then knight b5 is good? Or was it serendipitous that there was a queen on the board where you traveled to? Uh, the queen trade was something that we hadn't looked at before. We were looking at knight b5 without the queen trade. I mean, with, yeah, and with the queen still on the board. Knight b5 at basically all times is uh, problematic. Damn, dude. Yeah, we were looking oh, at it before, but here, wasn't too sure, and I just traded yeah. the queens because your uh, bishop. To be honest, blocking. I wanted you to play knight b5. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't <laughs> too down B5. to play it there. I mean, um, I guess when you when one of you plays knight b5, it's kind of obvious in hindsight what the other is looking for. Um, yeah, uh, yeah. Look, guys, I gotta go here. Uh, all right, all right. Okay. thanks for playing, Smoke. Yeah. I'm yes, yeah. not sure what else okay, could do because every other I, line felt just worse than this. Right, Andre says this was my idea. Uh, yeah. Ryan says this was also my idea. So, yeah, rip to all Sweet. of us. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I was thinking that uh, this turn would have been better to land on Neath, just because. Which turn? Uh, this turn here. I was more familiar with this. Without yeah, the queen, if we could... it looks simpler. Yeah, it I looks simpler. Words, but serendipitous. The problem is, I don't even think you can get there. There you go, Andrew. the problem. Not with knight b5 here. A turn later. I, I double as an uh, ESL maybe. stream. Um, man. Yeah, yeah. no, I, 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 going, I was upset that you guys played this opening. Because as black, I think that it's really annoying uh, if you haven't played it a bunch. Um, yeah. Yeah, I, I think that most of the time... I take the queen, I, I take with the queen, and then I just go right back to d8 after knight c3 kicks yeah. it. Um, I, that's just I don't think d8 has been a 
like is a necessarily good move. I think a5 is a fine move. Queen a5, yeah. Yeah, queen a5 is a fine move. Yeah, we didn't. Uh, I was thinking like. Uh, Effectively, in like a little bit of prep when we were looking at this, I was like, uh, I, don't, I don't know what to do against queen a5. I sometimes just play a a3 b4 and just try to get it out of the way. Interesting. How do you do that with the queen on b3? Uh, no, no, no. I, like before playing queen b3. Oh, I see. Yeah, and that was. Wait, me but that, that, that seems super well. terrible because then it just slides back to um. It just slides back to c7 and it defends f7, right? Probably. I mean, it's just not a great. Uh, I think here, like I when I saw queen a5, I was kind of happy with it, just because it doesn't seem like it does anything where it is. Yeah. Um, yeah, that's why I don't like it. Yeah. Ryan says and I, was gonna... I play queen h5 personally. Yeah, um, queen h5 I feel like is the better move. That makes um, a lot of sense. Queen h5 f7, or queen right f5 is what I've all, always looked at and seen as like good moves. Because queen, queen h5, you defend f5. Queen h5 seven, is a bit you better put pressure though. on knight f, the knight on f3, and it, it seems decent. I think that's probably it's still true. not like completely fine, and you have to know what you're doing though. So it's tricky as black. Queen f5 makes sense. Yeah. You need to go see ya? All right. But Take it easy, I was though. even that. I mean. Queen h Queen h5, I don't even know if it's actually that good. It definitely seems one of the best queen moves if you're going for this set. I guess um, it gives you I mean, maybe some more counterplay, and there's a defender on f7. Uh, yeah. So. The amount of counterplay fine. you get from the queen over there really isn't too much. It's the fact that it's on uh, the fifth rank, and it defends f7. Is what I found. Yeah, but queen h5 sure. and then bishop g4, and you can put a lot of pressure on the knight. So to be fair, one thing that I've found you can usually stop queen h5 bishop g4 and then from bishop being played. G4? What? You have to prepare for that. Oh, you mean that, for white? Like, oh, yeah, 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 I see what you're yeah. saying. Yeah. 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 The um, problem is white can quickly stop bishop g4 from being the, played in any reasonable amount of time. I don't know that that's true, because, I mean, if queen h5 happens, uh, you know, then, then you don't have to worry about... Um, like e6 to cover the diagonal you can play something like bishop b6 instead the thing is you take is b7 yeah b7 yeah but that's before free. no no okay so hold but on. you have to the, the knight that. has moved uh, and then you play queen h5 then what happens you're saying queen uh, b3 in queen that b3 situation b3. queen b3 uh yeah queen b3 just in every line i've seen so far it's generally the best move there's moves that I think yeah. make it not so great, and then I think white might be down a few tempo or something, but I, I haven't played enough of it. Yeah, I don't know. And I played this line against, uh, like, Dreamer and Ryan for uh, PM, and then got wrecked in both of those games, so. <laughs> like, Wait, when what? they played so, Queen so H5. So Queen H5 wrecked you? Uh, yeah. So what, queen so h5 I did and go then for queen a b3? <laughs> or uh, no? yeah. Like, queen h5, queen b3. So then what do they do? Uh... Did just d6? I've defense. seen multiple moves. I've seen knight d7, I've seen knight a6. I've seen people blunder the b-pawn. Knight um, d7. I guess so, because then you can play rook b8. And then... Nah. Knight e5? The idea is, uh, knight, uh, c5. Oh, sure. Defend the bishop and play knight c5, effectively. That makes sense. It's an annoying one to deal with, but... Yeah. I went knight well, d7. Good game. Ryan went knight d7. Alright, GG's, guys. Yeah. Well done. Well earned. Good luck with the rest of your games in the tourney. Yep, for you. We're going to win. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Looking Hopefully. forward to catching those games.